Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review for you this bench pillar drill from Parkside uh, and as always on the beginning some of the main features um, uh, it has uh, 500 watts uh, power consumption uh, rotation speed between 500 and uh, 250 rpms divided in uh, nine stages and actually i might maybe it would be better to show you straight away by changing position of this of those two belts you actually are is you are able to reach designed uh, speed and uh, what else sorry and by the way this happened during the the unbox the screw was not included so you might be able to see what is the inside okay it's only a switch emergency switch but still uh, in terms of uh, quality, I will give you my recommendation later on, but um, yeah. Uh, spidal travel, it's um, 50 millimeters. Uh, chuck is uh, B16 type. Uh, by the way, everything is heavy lubricated, so I'm skipping it inside of this uh, uh, foil. And diameter is from one and a half up to 16 millimeters. Drill uh, table angle is from minus 45 degrees up to 45. What else? Uh, maximum drill diameter it's uh, 25 millimeters in wood and only 10 in steel. Um, power cable three meters and uh, also you have uh, uh, two batteries or the laser indicator included which is uh, in my opinion a little bit how to call it I don't trust um, I will not even put batteries inside but I think it's a it's a gadget so and what is uh, unpleasant surprise I would say is uh, are those batteries are no named okay I don't expect to have uh, rechargeable batteries or, or something like that but you've got some silly I don't know Chinese batteries heavy duty I would I wouldn't say it's a heavy duty for sure JPP made in China or China okay uh, doesn't matter it's a gadget I don't think anybody will, will will use it so let's keep it still inside of this box and yes in terms of quality I have to admit I'm a little bit um, disappointed because okay uh, I had an opinion that the park site is doing reasonable uh, equipment for decent or I would say value for the money you are paying value for the money but this thing from from the start is not 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 showing any type of uh, confidence that it will work and for instance this one this part it's made out of aluminium it's not a steel and it will break soon uh, if from any reason you will apply uh, bigger force or something will fall down on this uh, so what to say I will just and, and, and by the way sorry uh, I didn't I did not uh, do it on purpose uh, nothing is working as it should I can, okay I can turn it okay 
I will just uh, try to run this baby for a two or three seconds just to hear how loud it's it's working but uh, uh, everything I mean everything is made in the way you see this this finish okay it's I know it's you, you, you normally you will not see it after uh, screwing screwing after assembling but um, I think uh, amount of this uh, lubricants it's only to prevent from the from rust, rusting uh, everywhere are sharp edges you can feel them all over the place it's this 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 finish is uh, unacceptable in my opinion it just it is just done and uh, and that's all okay Okay, it's not working. <laughs> okay, okay, it should be. What's wrong? Okay, and it's not working from the very beginning, so it's a crap. Please don't buy it. Invest your money in such in, in, in something else. It's a brand new, it doesn't work, it looks like a very badly assembled and made, everything is has sharp edges, no, 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 I highly not recommend you to buy this, and that's all. I'm taking my recipe and trying to give it back to Lidl. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye.